Good afternoon and welcome to this Pink Move video tour of this four bedroom detached property situated on Hunters Ridge in Caldecott. We're just starting off outside the front of the property now. And just ahead of us we have access to the large driveway. So the property is individual but it is set on a large corner plot which is a fantastic benefit. It gives you all of this space as a front garden area. So as well as a large driveway that's suitable for your off-road parking for multiple vehicles. You also have established plant life, trees and shrubbery, as well as a generous front lawn area that's well kept and fenced off. So double gates give you access to the driveway and from here we have access into the rear garden just via a side gate to the left and just in front of us now we have access into the property so as we step inside we come into a well presented hallway nice and spacious and well presented and this gives you access up to the first floor via the staircase as well as into all of your ground floor rooms. So head round to the right first. We'll head into the lounge. Lovely and bright as we have that large window that overlooks the front of the property, and that large front garden. Again, very nicely presented, an ample space for all of your required living room furniture. Room also features a fireplace, which acts as a lovely focal point to the room. Adjacent to this, you have converted garage space, which has now been turned into a second reception room. So currently being used as a study or home office, it could be used as a separate dining space, children's playroom, or a second sitting room, whatever your preference might be. And again, it's a well presented space, nice and modern, and laminate flooring underfoot running through from the hallway. So just before we get to the end of the hallway here, we have the convenience of a WC and hand basin. So nice and handy to have that in a large family property such as this one. And next to this, we have a utility room. So nice to have this separate from the kitchen again, to hide all your utilities and larger appliances away, keep the kitchen nice and tidy. So you have good amounts of storage, wall and floor, and space as well for your large appliances such as your washer and dryer. So another really handy space there. In the end, of the hallway we come into the open plan kitchen diner so just to the left here we do have space to house a large family sized dining table and chairs or perhaps to have it as the current vendors do with a second sitting area as the kitchen itself does allow for breakfast dining you have your breakfast bar a really good size space again nice and lovely and bright we have a doorway and windows overlooking the rear garden I'll show you that in just a moment decorative electric fireplace so nice and cozy and a really fantastic size kitchen stretching out to the other end of the room so as I say we have space for breakfast dining your large center island here offering you unit storage you also have your hand basin there just in the center on the far wall here we have space for your integrated appliances such as your oven you also have your gas hob multi burner and your extractor fan as well as further unit storage and at the end of the room here 
we have access into the conservatory. So this is being used as the dining space. Really beautiful and bright and well presented. A lovely pop of colour just on the walls there at the bottom. We have double doors leading out into the rear garden. I'll show you that in just a moment. And lovely views again over the rear garden. It's really nice to have these doors open. We we'll use this as a sitting space in the summertime. Ideal for hosting and for parties, this space. So we'll head outside now and I'll show you the rear garden. As we exit just to the left, have your gated access, space for the refuse and recycling bins and for your garden storage shed. The main garden area opens out into lawn space, decorative slate just to the left, space for your flower borders and your plant life. Have a pathway that leads round the side of the conservatory and just at the rear of the garden here we have a slightly raised deck area for your garden furniture and your seating. Again with established trees and plant life. It's a really lovely garden, nice and private and fully enclosed as well. And then the garden continues and we have a large patio area again with space for your flower borders and further space for your seating. It's a really fantastic family sized garden and again further storage here. Really fantastic space. So we'll head back inside now. Head upstairs and I'll show you the first floor. So head back towards the hallway where we have the staircase and we'll head round to the left first as we come up the stairs and onto the landing. So just to the right here we have storage cupboard, this is the airing cupboard and then we have our first bedroom. So beautifully presented overlooking the rear of the property, this is bedroom number three. Also have the built-in storage just to the left here, so saves you room on larger furniture. This is a good sized single bedroom here. Next up we have bedroom number two, so this is the first double bedroom that we're seeing. Again, really well presented and this time overlooking the front of the property. Plenty of space to move around as well as to house your double bed or larger and your wardrobe space. Just across from the staircase we have the family bathroom featuring your WC and hand basin. You also have your ornate bath with a wall mounted shower above. This area is tiled for your maintenance and your cleaning. Over to the other side of the landing now and we have bedroom number four. So a good sized bedroom here, could house a double bed but currently being used as a twin. Again overlooking the rear garden. And last but not least we have the master bedroom. It's a really spacious area here, again nice and bright and beautifully presented. 
You have your built-in wardrobes either side of the bed there. So plenty of storage space. And just behind me as well. You have built-in storage just to the side of the ensuite. Ensuite bathroom itself. It's very generous in size. You have EWC and your hand basin. Plenty of storage underneath there. And you also have your shower cubicle as well. So overall, a really fantastically spacious and well presented family property. And this concludes our Pink Move video tour. So if you're interested in viewing this property, please contact a member of the Pink Move team today to book an appointment. Thanks for watching.